Hey guys, it's Allie from Allie'sBlog.ca. I have some new nail polish here for you today. So this is OPI's color paint set. I saw this a little while ago on another YouTube and I thought it was really cool and I found it today at Winners for $14 so I thought why not pick it up. So as you can see I have the mini set here. So I have uh, a few different colors. So I've got the silver canvas here that's the undercoat then I've got the primary yellow the chromatic orange pen and pink and then I've got purple perspective and tur turquoise and a stick so I have a bunch of different colors here for you so I'm gonna just go ahead and open up this box and pull them all out we're actually gonna be using all these colors today for the nail design that I'm gonna be doing so first off on my nails I just have my base coat which is the quick dry base coat by Revlon I like this one because it dries really fast obviously so I have that on my nails first and right now we're going to start off by doing the silver undercoat I'm just going to go ahead and take all of these out because I'm going to use all of them today um, so pretty much you'll be using the OPI set and then another orally nail polish and then you're just your um, top coat and base coat so this is the little silver one here so I'm just going to go ahead and paint my nails with just one coat. I like this silver because it's actually quite thick, so I think I'm only going to use one coat for this nail design. I did try them out before just because I wasn't sure what I wanted to do with them yet. There's lots of different designs you can do, I think, with this set, which I think is really cool. There are a few other colors, but they didn't come in the mini set, so... So there you go, you have the whole silver coat. Um, as you can see, it is pretty opaque. Um, I cover my nails pretty well, and that's just one coat. So I think I'm just going to stick with the one coat. I find it is kind of thicker nail polish. Um, so that's why I was dipping into the bottle so much, because I found I didn't have enough on the brush. But still, I think it's pretty good. So we're going to let that dry, and I'll be back in a minute. So I am back. Um, it didn't take that long to dry. It seems pretty dry right now and I didn't even put it on a top coat so we're going to go with it. So next what you're going to do is you're going to take um, Orly's like, Sparkle Holographic Nail Polish. This is uh, Prism Gloss Silver. I really love this nail polish. I'm hoping I can find another one soon because I'm kind of running out. So what we're going to do is we're just going to paint all of our nails with this nail polish. I kind of want some sparkles underneath. It's just, you don't have to do too thick of a coat, but depending on how sparkly you would like it to be. Now you can use um, thicker glitters if you want. It's just kind of whatever you want to do. It will show up through the OPA, OPI nail polish because it is pretty transparent so you can do whatever you want. I just decided to do a holographic. Alright, so now you have it. Very sparkly. So you're gonna let that dry for a little bit and I... Alright, so it's dry. 
I'm going to start off with the pink and pen nail polish. Um, just going to open it up. And what you're going to do is, is you're going to just take off like majority of the nail polish. Uh, this is like I did in the Distress Nails. It's like a dry brush nail design. So you're going to take off pretty much like all of the nail polish. So what I'm going to do is I'm only going to do like one stripe on each nail. So I'm just going to brush it across real quick. I'm going to do it on the same direction for each nail. You can see how it's like a very light color there. So now you're going to take your next color, which is going to be the turquoise. Looks a lot darker in the bottle than it turns out to be. So same thing, take off pretty much all of the nail polish again. And I'm going to go the other way this time. So I'm kind of doing like an X. And you see how in the middle it actually made like purple. So next color is actually purple, funnily enough. The same thing, all the nail polish off. And then you're going to do another line. So next color is the orange. I really like how when you overlap these polishes it makes a, a different color. I'm gonna get some more of this one just a little bit. All right, and last is the yellow. So the yellow I'm actually going to put in a few different spots because I wanted to make um, different colors and pull it all together kind of thing. don't have all the colors you can still make all of them with all the colors you have which I think is pretty cool 
All right. So they're very colorful. So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your top coat and you're just gonna give it a coat there. So I'm gonna be using uh, Revlon's Quick Dry Top Coat. This is one of my favorite quick dries that isn't too expensive, but still a good top coat. the final result. They do kind of look messy in a way, but I kind of like them. Tell me what you think. And I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope that you check out the OPI color paints. Thanks for watching.